Whew. Finally, get on the road. Jeez. Do you guys find at the beginning of the season, it takes a miracle to get you out the door? Holy crap, man. Luckily, I have fuel. The way this morning <clears throat> has been going, it seems like it seems like I've been trying to get out of the door the last hour with this thing. There goes the lawn truck. It's funny. Right as I'm pulling out. Uh, okay. <laughs> Hi. Hey guys, Chuck with Birch's Lawn Care here. And now we are finally, finally getting on the road at noon to go mow been to the auction i got the toolbox picked it up actually pretty happy with the toolbox i only spent 50 bucks on it put a little picture of it here somewhere or whatever of it open it the doors all open nice usually sometimes you get lucky and there'll be tools it wasn't really anything in there a paint scraper and just scraps of projects but uh no actual tools so oh well on that one um, the last couple times from the auctions I've been ripped off we're not ripped off made bad bids because they don't guarantee anything at an auction the last couple toolboxes I've picked up from the auction they've had busted doors and the rollers were bad and so when I told my wife that I had to go pick up another another toolbox from the auction she was like oh my god she goes you are never going to learn your lesson so anyway that's enough babble for this morning let's go mow grass
Well, all right. I guess my skills of the GoPro. I don't know if I killed the battery or killed the GoPro. This GoPro battery, Go Pro batteries do not seem to last too long. I'd much rather fertilize, kill weeds, and mow, trim and edge. I'd rather do the, the basic maintenance and my fertilizer gig. I really don't like the bush trim. I, uh, it's not even something I advertise. I, I do it for my customers if I'm asked, but I know that's not my strong suit. So anyway, eh, it is what it is, right? So it was just that and then it was a mow. I was surprised that the grass had grown at all since the only water we've had is the snow we had over the weekend. That's been a two week cut and I had it on 275 and I was still getting grass out of it. I cut it at 2.5 a couple weeks ago. But uh, I would have got more of the final edge because I, I just did the blade edge today. I didn't do it when I was here two weeks ago. I didn't even have my uh, blade edger on the combi. So I just did a string edge. I didn't get crazy with cutting it in just because I knew I'd be back. So I cut it in with the blade. I didn't get any final picks because right as I'm blowing it off, uh, a guy stops in the middle of the street lives two houses down on me come and give him an estimate so of course I'll come and give you an estimate you know so that was a uh, I didn't take the camera with me probably why the GoPro died because it was on the mower <coughs> I may not have turned it off I don't even know but anyway that's what's going on and now it is 345 I've kind of I've only done two long start until noon and did some tree trim and bush trimming on both properties and for you guys that want to know why I don't take my 52 out those two lawns we've seen the action mow on today those are the larger of my lawns um, which is why I don't take the, actually the first one I to have mowed it with the 52 just when the 52 is on the truck I will because uh, I can get it in the gates but those are those are large lawns for me so that's why the 36 suits me best those lawns aren't very big and they would be what I would consider 52 inch lawns so anyway guys I gotta get off here before I destroy somebody and uh, so yeah so...